Hello my friends and welcome back to our continued plan let's play Secret of Evermore with guidance and assistance from the King of Giant Robots, our dear friend Asapa. It's your boy here to bite all the baddies and sniff out all the secrets of Evermore. Indeed my friends and we are streaming on Twitch and then uploading this to YouTube and it's been a lot of fun. I'm having a lot of fun. Let's not waste any time. Let's jump back into it, shall we? Well, that was a nicely timed little, whatever this is, Sh giant shell? coconut shell. <laughs> the dog is hilarious. Hours later. Now let's see if. Hmm. To ship? Well, dang it. Where'd my dog go? Whoa, now I can know. Now I know how Dandy Don Carlisle felt in Sink Boat Sink. I think I got water in every orifice, pocket and pore. Hmm, no sign of Zappa. Zappa? Nope. I better look around. So this is where that uh that that the effort was supposed to have paid off, but I guess because you died, it does not pay off. What would have happened? There's supposed to be another character that was there for like two seconds, fiddles with the box, and then walks away. But it's a very specific character that would have applied some suspicion into the plot. I'm sorry I died and messed that up. Eh, it's whatever. Still can't believe I died there. You're not to treasure riches like the rest of these arts, are you? The last thing we need is more adventures around here. You don't take kindly to your people around here. There's tales of treasure and jewels in the land across the river. I go there, but I think I'm gonna wait till the weather clears up. Who the taste of the West Bank are very valuable indeed. Leader of Nobilia is supposed to find me out for them. Arr, they flood watchers are scourge they are. My brother, Tiny, is the strongest man in these parts. Wait, hold on. That's not the right voice for him. If that's Tiny's brother, now he's in Nobilia working in the market. It's honest work for a man like my brother. Yes, you, that's the voice you want for... Can't talk busy punching. Do you mind? You mind, kid? I'm trying to hit each other here. <laughs> that, oh, that jug. That, that jug is valid. The, jug the is orange valid. jug above the punchman. Oh. Oh, wait a second. This is a prehistoric land. No, it's not. We got pirates here. That's correct. Enemies. enemies. Yeah, yeah, this is not prehistoric land anymore. That was a magician. Don't let that guy hit you. He has your your favorite status effect. Why does At least it only flips thing? it flips your controls. It turns your left, right, and up, down, backwards. Change money? One talent for- one jewel for every two talents. So I gotta do this? Um, unless you want to hang on to your talents. And earn up from- start from scratch. Okay, what's your opinion? Trade it in, you're not gonna need those talents for a very long time. So trade in? Yes. Yeah, that's not bad. Okay, At see. this point, nectar is what's going to be saving your butt. I have five of them. 
Yes, but that's that should be your primary healing item. For like, like petals, you're like, oh, I have too many petals. Let me use one. So which way do I go here? Because there's a lot of different directions, and I'm trying to find my was, dog. Was there a a, grid, a a thing in there? Did you pick up a vase or something? See, there's <laughs> supposed to be word for the treasures on the other side of the river. I'm going to need to them. I am. Uh, let me double check. Just so I can mark it off of the tracker. Yeah, there it is. I think I got it. Yes. It's going to be those, and then it's going to be like brown jug, uh, brown vases with lids on them. Dang, I didn't see Over the here. item. Talk to me. Over here, in the big box. Since the waters have risen, some of the midget has been staying aside. That guy. Hey, my friend, I have a good deal for you. Can offer this rare and powerful amulet of annihilation for 10,000 jewels. You got a deal? You ain't got enough cash for that deal. So, is that a legit no. thing? Yes, but there was also a, a thing in there. So, here's the thing with that guy he will always come back and forth and be there again. You can always, for some reason, purchase. An amulet of annihilation from him for ten thousand jewels, but okay. he will offer you. You can't ever talk to him. He leave him alone. And now you're back down to the bottom. Got it. Go on, go ahead. That's fine. So, when you buy an amulet, he kind of feels bad for suckering you, so he will give you uh, an increasing tier of items. The first tier that you get is a chocobo egg. There's another way to get a chocobo egg later. It's treasure to be found in the West Bank on the river. And I'm the one that's going to find it. I so, forget what the second tier item he gives you. But what does but it... Is the amulet of annihilation good? It is a progression item. Okay, so you need to buy one eventually. Eventually, but this is not the place. Alright. And there is uh, an equipment store here. You need a crustacean, ain't you? The well, people in this town look mean, but we ain't all that bad. And it's every road for himself on the other side of the river. The city on the other side of the Great Desert. You might convince a ghost pirate to give you passage across the sand. Ghost pirates? Ghost right. pirates. Friendly ghost pirates. I may see you be wanting to buy some of the armor. It's the finest. Upgrades. Now, do not buy a spiky collar. You will get a free one later. But I can buy the other stuff, right? You, for every piece of equipment you buy here, you will be receiving free upgrades in a manner of speaking. It... <sighs> There is a sequence that we will probably be doing later where in you can get one or two or even three tiers of upgrade if you play the mini game correctly. Well, I'm going to buy this now. Yes, absolutely. Totally do it. You need it. It's helpful. But don't buy this Mikey collar. Right. First off, you don't have a dog right now. Massive defense boost. Very much. Can I sell my armor? You can. It's not going to be worth too much, but you can. And that was worth quite a bit. Huh. That's weird. What? The, the icon for your dog looked different. Oh, I didn't even notice. Dang it. All right, you've picked up everything in town. Okay, so which way to my dog? 
Which we'll way to the dog is stage right. Where the sorcerer was? Yes. It doesn't always happen, but sometimes he can hit you with confound. And it just reverses your left and right and up and down. Man, how do you miss? It's a wizard. He's chunky. He a chunky boy. Now, That's if you boy. dared, you totally could grind your way to 10,000 jewels. I'd rather find my doggo. Well, that's that's along the path. Oh my god, oh. just did 51 damage to me. Yes, they hurt. I'm glad I bought that armor, that may have killed me. I got no pedals anymore. Well, Nectar is your best friend anyhow. It heals a lot more. Okay, way to my dog. Up. Hoping it won't say that. There's a lot of enemies here. You got plenty of space to work. I did do a whole lot. <laughs> it's still level one, if that. Dang it! Oh, level Yo! three. Yo! Welcome to real power. Welcome to the ultimate secret technique of Infinirun. Wow, that does damage. Okay, you have two options. Mm -hmm. I want you to take option A. Go up. Not in it. Well, that was option B. You said go up, and I went up. <laughs> well, little friend, you're glad to see you around here. We go wash out here. Likewise, my dog and I used your boat to float downstream and over the falls. Yeah, well done. <laughs> I skip my floating down with my swamp flowers full of ants and some mud pepper. You seen this world? It's much different than the world on the plateau. I've explored a little, but I mainly been looking for Zappa. I wonder where he could be, and what he could be. Oh, yo! You look pretty! An Egyptian Greyhound. Guess what? Guess what the dog can do right now? What? Dog can leap across distances. That's that's the bit. That's what they're trying to show you. My wife and myself take care of cleaning and maintaining the palace. It's amazing. I love Egyptology. And th there is a, a wife somewhere here in the courtyard to talk to. So if I'm way in Pirate World... There you go. How do we get back together? Hey there, don't track any dirt in the palace. It's my job to keep the place clean. Calling me, sir? Yes, Pompanilius. I am ready to take the next step towards it. It's my advice you can help me obtain the overwhelming power that I desire. I must have the diamond eyes of the dog statue. But, sir, the people will not support your actions unless we receive a sign from the sacred dog. I hate to burst your bubble, Pomp, but the sacred dog is a myth. You can't expect some mystic creature to simply slide into the palace. Or... Uh, sir, we have a visitor. Well, friend. Well, friend. Time for you to find your pooch for me to continue my studies of things louder than air. 
I hear there's a great city on the other side of the desert to the north. You might have enough for your new dog over there. You can cross over the desert on my new bread. Where you take off once you have this crush formula. You mix limestone and wax for enemy crushing power. That sounds cool. Yes, um, it's about time to replace something. Because crush is a really, a genuinely good long-term spell. So replace those and just use crush. Yeah, acid rain, kind of lame. Crush, good stuff. It's, it's your choice between hardball and flash. I would keep either one of them with whichever you, you like more. There's no such thing as elements in this well, game. Well, this it's one all... uses wax, and that one uses wax, so... They would conflict with one another? Yeah, basically. Fair enough. Do you like to buy stuff? Hey, look, you don't have to buy mud peppers, and you only ever need one more. Sweet. Get that oil. Eh, crystals. Oh, yeah, that's for your hardball. Bone? You don't need bone in yet. So we don't need any, we, we don't have any bone in wings. S spend it, spend it all. Which one uses heal? Uh, it is water and roots. It doesn't sell roots. Nope, not here. Now, right. uh, the thing I wanted you to do was uh, to go upward and, and not have a bridge there yet. Feel free to jump in at your leisure. What do you mean jump in? Just fall into the pit. Stupid missing. But you see now, it is a lie. It no longer stops when it hits one thing. And does a lot more damage. Obviously. That's quite far. I hope you all came now, kid. Thanks for putting me out of that ditch, Blimp. I think I'll be alright. Yeah, I was correct. Use my bridge to cross over the desert. You want to change your magic? You want to buy stuff. You want to save stuff? You buy some stuff, you save some stuff. You save some stuff, you buy some stuff. See you later. All right, now you can go north. God, those cross guys the bridge. hurt. Cross the bridge, don't heal. Just cross the bridge and go. Believe in me. I want to kill these guys first. All right then, just don't get hit anymore. Trying to show you something neat. Actually, we're going to actually learn a technique here while 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 we have the freedom. Charge your meter, full charge. Now hold that button, and now hold your run button. Do not release. As long as you do not touch a wall. You have infinite run. You will need that. Ah, cool. And I feel like that. This is fine. You don't need to heal. Just believe in me and go north. Ignore these guys. Welcome to the Great Desert. Go north. Look at that. Now, you see a boat there. I want you to kind of ignore the boat. It's like damage from something. Yes, it's a desert. It's hot. Hey, Skipper, you want to lift? No, right? Oh, you can say sure. You said ignore the boat. I wanted you to walk past it, but this is fine. You can say sure. Right across the hot desert costs you one nine minute annihilation. You got one? 
I think you're mistaken, Skipper. You ain't got an amulet. You can't ride without one. Okay, and it goes to just kind of straight north. Using the technique of run forever. Because guess what? Twice. Infinite spawning enemies. Kind of angle yourself only a little bit to the right. Wait, no, stay here. Hit that. that so that, that oasis, that's a reference point. And if yeah. you stand in there, you fully heal. Oh, sweet. Uh, you're going to want to go north by northwest of here. Mostly up a little bit to the right. That's I not said west. west. Do not ask me why I get my le my right and left backwards. Now, mostly up, though. Because there should be another oasis. But it is not directly north. Yeah, that'll happen. God. Okay, maybe a little bit more to the the left, the left. We should have hit it already. Should I go back? Mm, yes, but the trick to going back, we're, we're looking for something in particular, is to run at a diagonal. Nothing will catch you because you actually move twice as fast. Unless that happens. I, I... I'm going to die out here. Yeah, because the, the Oasis didn't get get pained. Trust Ryudo, this ain't easy. <laughs> Ryudo probably wasn't wa get, had, didn't have a guide. He had like 300 people in chat yelling at him. Eventually, you'll you'll get out of the desert. Oh, thank you, Rito. Appreciate that. Stupid tumbleweeds. Yeah. I am super lost. Just keep going down. Eventually, you will exit the desert. And then we can reset to find the thing. There we go. All right, let's go back north and try it again. And then go straight up from here. Me, yeah, um. Safe save, yes. Fair emergency enough. saved. All right, so north? Yeah, go straight north, and that'll take you to one oasis. Okay. And then keep going straight north. Just go north. So yeah, slightly back to the the slightly back to the left. Said then now go up. Just go straight up. I'm 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 going off of a guide and not off of memories now. There it is. There's so supposed, supposed to be a guy to use here. The, uh, am I supposed to use the, uh, the the boat guy to get through this? Yes, but unless you go and grind out getting an amulet of violation, you do have to run it. Okay, so where to next? Uh, there's supposed to be a guy here. There's no so, guy. Okay. Here. Go straight north. Just keep going straight north. Is 
This reminds me of what was it? Breath of Fire 3? Breath of Fire 4? One of them had a desert. I think they both had a desert. Three was, the a, really three was a desert, four was the Great Plains. Okay, keep going north. There's supposed to be a dude standing at one of these oases. But at least on the, along this path, you have these resting spots. If you were to go away from straight no of, of the, this path, you don't get them. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. I believe you. I don't know why he's not here. Unless you can... I know if we, if we, if we find this guy later on, he, he will give you us a free spiky collar, so... Maybe he doesn't show up without the dog in your party. That's all, That would be stupid. Oh, hello. Well, you're there. Excellent, you're here. Okay. Now we're gonna go to the right. Do not, do not go in town. So go right. Drop a safe state. Drop a safe state. We have to talk. Or bring up the menu. That works. Okay. You are about to engage in a 15-minute timer known as the Nobilian Market. This is the point where if you can effectively min-max all of your training, you can get the best tier armor and free relics or accessories or trinkets or whatever you want to call them but you have to do everything in a 15 minute timer okay do you have confidence that you could do that or do you want to not nah, pass it's not that big of a deal i can try it at least fair enough all right problem is you i have no idea what i'm getting myself into so it's kind of hard oh. to say if i can do it or not Okay, so this is why I was suggesting dropping a safe state. We're going to do a couple of things to set up for it. Because anything that you can get is not missable. It just... You don't get yet. Because, because there is a tier system when it comes to the armor, if you have the highest level armor, when you get the free armor upgrade before the next boss, it turns into a charm. A trinket, an accessory, whatever. Instead of being armor, because you can't get any better armor. Okay. But you can also get that trinket later by other means. This is just the secret free upgrade. So what do I do? I have. So you're going to go to the left. I have to actively use my hand and wave my hand around. And you're going to go to the left of here. So don't enter the city yet. Correct. Do not go in the city. Go left. Go left. Now, slightly down from that rock, if you stop moving, you found it. What? You were there, but you have to deal with these idiots. So probably cast defend and heal yourself. There we go. Okay. So what do I do? You you are going to take damage because you're on the desert. You're going to take damage. So you see how it's, it's got you moving? Yeah. Don't resist. Stop pushing directions. Chill. Okay. We sit here. Why do I feel like you're poisoned? I don't remember the damage chicks going off that frequently. What are we waiting for? Well, we're waiting to fall into the whirlpool. What, we just spin around? Mm-hmm. Their dialogue boxes will pop up, but you can heal. Just don't move out of there. Someone play that song. Bring around the roses. Right round. You spin me right round, baby, right round, like yeah, a desert, one. baby, right round, round, round. 
Yeah, go ahead and feel free to heal. Just don't push any directions. Oh, getting dizzy. Yep. Yeah, stay alive. It's okay. That's that's fine. That's normal. You've triggered the first check. How the heck are people supposed to find out about this? Nintendo Power. <laughs> Guess what? This is for, this was for the devs. This is for debugging. Round and round I go. Oh, does it tick this fast? Where I stop, only Zap and view to know. <laughs> and maybe some other people watching in my uh, on my that channel right common. now. Spin, 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 wee! Did he say that? Looking yeah. away. Okay, cool. Then we should probably have about another minute or so. Like, seriously, how are people supposed to know about this? It's absolutely Nintendo insane. power. Because, like I said, this was for dev debugging. Eventually, you will disappear into the ether. I'm glad hitting that little edge right there doesn't count against it. Got a got an Earl. All right, two. This is the weirdest. There, there's, there this is, is another like dev teleport to go skip the desert, but that's like advanced speed run tech. I'm not even going to try to figure that one out. This is some weird stuff right here. Yep. Okay, someone just left their secret stash where they shouldn't have. Oh, something there you go. Hey, where am I? I'll just kind of button mash as you go to the left. The left? Or the right, sorry. See the rice. rice Alright, now bring up your inventory. No, uh, you're gonna wanna go that Where too, yes. Oh, because you're in the shade. Alright, you go to your inventory. Or kill the spider first. I feel better about that spider being gone. Yeah, I will too. Right, That's Yep, so that purple pouch. Okay. Yeah, 99 rice and 99 spice. Do you have a good start for your trading adventure? And then on your charms, you should only still have the Jaguar tooth. So, since we're playing on emulation, we have the power of save states. So, uh, I am going to do two things here. I'm not going to be able to see chat as I'm bringing up a, um, I had one of the pages open. I didn't have both that I wanted. I don't know how to switch my save state. I have one save state. This is fine. You only need one for the marketplace. The chart. Yes, the chart. Bring up the chart. Yes. All right. So I have now both a trade chart and a map. Do you want me to send you the map? Uh, I don't know if I'll be able to do okay. two things at this is why. So here, here's the point of the first save state. So you can go in and explore at your leisure before we start the 15 minute timer. I do have step by step instructions. All which, right. So all right. go inside and just talk around. 
Yeah, go outside and explore. Explore. There is one in particular thing that you can save state after, and it's going to be right here. Talk to that man in green. Bend is near! Eat my warning! Eat my warning! Keep talking to him. He's got more than two. We are in for a cataclysmic event, the likes of which we have never seen. The new leader of our world is not what he seems. He has evil intentions that will trigger a cataclysm. The diamond eyes are key to the coming cataclysm. Do not let them fall into the wrong hands. Somebody is watching over us, controlling us. It's true, I tell you, it's true. His name is Flightless Bird. We are merely sprites that dance at the beck and call of a butt pressing overlord. <laughs> That's great. This is a video game. Don't you see? We are characters in a video game. This guy is a nutcase. If I am lying, may be struck down by the powers that be. Stop. You have four options. I see three. You have a fourth option. Okay. Well, it's, I mean, you're you're going to reload. So, what what do you choose? Do you want A, B, C, or do you want to know what the fourth option is? Should I put a save state here, or? Has ah. time already begun to tick? Uh, time is stopped because you're in a dialogue box. You're in this dialogue box. All right, what's the fourth option? Cancel. I thought so. Push Y. I thought so. Just don't. Don't punish him. I can't cancel. Uh, it, it's not. Oh, the, there you go. Please take this word, but not turn me into something you are kind so That that's that's equipment upgrade. You don't want to do that now though. So that we will undo that later. Yeah, because kind of he wacko. he is a he that is how you upgrade a piece of equipment. Oh. So I don't want to do that now. Right, you wanna do that later. Ceramic pots. There's a trick to ceramic pots that we will do after this. So, the, the ceramic pots have a secret hidden inside them completely at random. For every time you buy a bundle of five or ten, you can get jewels, or there is an 8% chance you get the chocobo egg. Okay, so this guy is the one who's the timer? And every now and again, somebody will tell you that they're closing up in a certain number of minutes. Just just kind of try to memorize who's selling what. There's no way I can do that. Look, look at what's on there. Look at what's on their shelves. But this is also why I have the map. I, I'm, I'm sorry, Zappa. There are limits to my brain at this okay. stage in my life and i'm telling you i'm not going to be able to memorize this okay then you uh, that's i said that's why i have a map because when you're in menus time also stops time does not count on the timer talk to this guy buy one he healed you talk to him again Hmm. He teaches you an alchemy spell, but I think it might be after the fact. Okay. Yeah, I think it's after. That's, that's all that is. So what is the game plan here? Do you want... Did you want to upgrade your stuff or no? Or do you just want to You're my let navigator. this rock? Tell me. Well, is anything that we do in this, in this, in this time frame can be done after. This is just... Free upgrades for a boss fight. Okay, well, tell me what's what's up. What's optimal for you is to just explore, but we need to go find the end, which is uh, starting on that screen on the other side. Should I load my save state? Uh, nah. Sure. We're going to get you an alchemy. Yes. 
But I believe you have the skills to beat the boss without having the, the, the region equivalent of best armor. Oh, so we're just going to ignore this. Yeah, you can explore, you can talk to people, and then after the fact, at our leisure, I will guide you through the process of getting all of the charms and armor. All right, well, let me um, go back to the save state so I haven't bought oh. anything yet. Right. And then we'll... Do I want to talk to this guy? Uh, he... he that is a, that is still a free armor upgrade. I know, but do I want to do it now? No. Okay. Let, it, let him cook. So let's ignore these people for now. Okay. And we'll come back to this when there is no time limit. How's that? Good enough. And then what? Go all the way so, to the right and up. So back, uh, back, yes, back up and to the right. There was, there's a, there was a screen transition that you hit. There you right go. Here. Yes. Now we're gonna go down. I will trust that new leader. We haven't even seen the guy. Why does he show his face, huh? And then in there. Hello, young that man. is gonna be the end. Hope you aren't a ruffian like those bullies in Custacia. Okay. Hey, that's a spider. What's that spider do? <gasps> the heck? What's the meaning of this? Why you disturb my race? I, I'm sorry, I didn't know. You skinny little guy, ain't you? You need more meat on your bones. You need brute strength. Got just the thing for you, the power of Atlas. Uh, super strength. So I assume that increases our damage. That increases your strength a lot, but also one of the best animations in the game. What did, what did your boy Don used to always say? Don? Don. From Inescapable. Like Gaza? No, that, that's Giovanni. Oh. Who's Don? Brain the bunch. jock. In green. Ah, the policeman? Pal? Yeah. What yeah, about pal. it, pal? Now, what did he always used to do? For no reason. I always heard his voice clip going... Well, you just have to cast a spell and you'll see. Just gotta In work order for out you to some use more. this atlas formula, you need one atlas medallion. I offer you one for 100 jewels. Deal? Yes. Use that wisely. Now, you he will sell you up to three... The second one costs two one fifty. The third costs two hundred. So I can only use that spell once. Well, you can only carry three Atlas medallions at a time. So I can only use it once. What do you mean once? Because I only have one medallion. Currently, yes. A lot of Anytime volume. <laughs> Anytime you don't have three, you can go talk to him and purchase one at a time. What are wings? Uh, dungeon escape. Honey? Uh, better healing than nectar. Okay, where to now? Um, this is just a couple of spots. We will need stuff here later. Now, there is one item that I need you to trade for once we get back into the main market. So I, got the I main think market. we can I think we can do it now. If not, then it won't be able to be done until afterward. The main market. Mm hmm. Do -do -do. Talk right. to this lady. Newly is advising to call a meeting in City Square. We'll be closing in 12 minutes. When I sort of wards and wall hangings, my finest piece of time is pretty bummy five cats playing poker. Price is three bees per tapestry. Uh, one. You need at least four total. Okay, so we need to get beads. My bad. Where we get beads? Uh, let me find your best deal. Not buying beads, you want to trade for beads. Hmm. Okay, uh, silver sheets, we'll do that later. I know, I'm just... Okay, no, it's going to be... Since you're standing there, we're going to go all the way to the left and then down. Once you hit the wall. So down from here, past the guard, 
This guy. One bag of rice or three jewels. So I mean, buy no ten. You're gonna you're gonna need a lot of beads later. So buy some but, more. Eh, nah. Just buy enough for now. I'll buy fifteen. Okay. Now go back to Miss Tapestry. You said I need uh, four? You will need four total. So buy three and then one. Okay. All right. Okay, now we're going to go all the way up to the north. And that'll hit another screen transition. Found it. No. No. Wrong one. I heard that something Oops. cool happened when the diamond eyes are putting the statue. Wait, what happened? We're going to go back, and then there's a different... I said north. You went. You went east. You said no screen transition. That was a screen transition. Fair enough. Whoever has the dudes found a secret dog, we'll find out in the big meeting. Hey, there, there's a rock. Yeah. What, you sh what should you do with that rock? Should I do it now? You should levitate it now. This is the last time you ever need to cast Levitate. I am Tiny the Barbarian. I am the strongest creature alive. Nobody needs my rock but me. You know, it's ironic that your name is Tiny because you're actually very large. Yeah, thank you for pointing that out. Yes, Tiny likes irony. You want Tiny to show you the real way to leave the rock. I do it for a tapestry from the market. Lift, it's a deal. Clear the way. This is going to be good. Oh! Togam! <laughs> now, that's how you leave the rock. And I can tell, like, somewhere in the future, there's going to be... Yeah, I wonder if that lock will ever land. There's yes, going to be, like, will. some gap that I can't cross unless that rock is there, right? That is correct. Frick the champion is going to battle today. I'm his biggest fan. Stitch is commissioned by our new leader to honor his mentor. I think it's a little pretentious. Alright, where to now? Um, we literally have to wait until the market closes. So, I mean, we can take the first steps to getting everything if you want to get started. Sure. Okay. So we're going to go back down to the market. Straight down. To the market. Going to do some shopping. Bye, Tiny. Yeah. So we have 80 rice already. We started with rice. So we're going to need to go and trade. Trade rice for 20 spices. Let me find the right space because there's there are optimal deals. So we're going to go to the right, to the left, to the left. I have 99 spice. Mm. Fair oh, enough. It, yeah, okay, I don't need so to trade can, rice for spice. <laughs> we can skip that step. Trade rice for spices. So we have 80. We want to have 42 rice, 87. Okay, cool. We need to go to beads. One rice and three jewels. We want to have a total of 14 beads. Why? For trading. Okay, because I already had the tapestries. Right. So that's probably a few less that we're going to need. I would say get... An, uh, it's this guy. Not her. He's for few. Shoot, okay. Let me do that. That's fine. This is fine. How many perfumes do I need? I, I'm following things in order. You need eight. Eight perfumes? I believe so. Alright, and where is the um the bead seller? Uh down and to the left. Don't worry about him, you have spice. This guy. Up. Oh. We're not there yet. We don't have chicken. This dude. So uh ten. That should cover it. Alright, what next? That should be good enough. All right, so buy 11 chickens. 
which is going to be for one spice and two rice. Let me find optimal chickens. Uh, it should, okay, go down from here, straight down. Wait, no, let's ceramic pots. Never mind, never mind. Uh, yes, we do want to go down, though. We go all the way down, past, past, take a right, go up, and this lady, selling chickens. We want 11 chickens. 11? 11 chickens total. Which I believe this list also sets you up for the super future. All right, so I got 11 chickens. What now? Okay, we bought three. We already took care of the tapestries. How many per firm did you end up buying? Eight? Yes. All right, good. We are set. Uh, we need to get limestone tablets. Two limestone tablets, which is, um, you remember that weird space past the, past the, the Atlas armlet guy? Or the Atlas? We're going to call him Atlas. We have to go through a building. So, go. This is the end. Yeah, so we found down. the end. Oh. But it wasn't that building. Sorry. But now you know where the end is at. We're going to go screen transition. Down. And through this building. Cut across. And we want two limestone tablets from this this first lady here. Two? Yeah. Yes. She hasn't had much business because she's in a very inconvenient place. Okay. Got the two limestone tablets. All right. Two tablets. Four jeweled scarabs, which is the person next to her. Okay. All right, we need to get two golden jackals. Which so, I'm looking for way. golden jackals. Yeah, because we're done with that side forever. Jackal, jackal, it's a jackal. Where are the jackals? Uh, okay, um, from that lady, since you're right there, we're going to go up. And we're going to go left. And at the end of this column, this guy. This the dog looking guy. How many? Uh, let me double check. Three golden jackals. Or but you want to trade for chicken. Or chicken? Yes, trade for chickens. That is why you're getting the chickens. And I need three of them? Uh... You need three golden jackals. Having more is is fine. And I'm training chickens. Yes. Okay, got three. So that's three. All right. We're gonna go buy the ruby heart. This is so convoluted. Is, yes, it is. Like so point from him, entry. we're gonna go to the left and down. Past that. Further down, uh, dogman here. Yes, trade the ruby heart for tapestry and jeweled scarab. Uh, other goods. There you go. You now have a charm. I do. Lowers the enemy chance to lightning blow. Cool. All right, what Evasion now? Evasion slightly goes up. Uh, we are going to get by the Jade Disc. Which is? Which is... Jade Disc is the lady to the left. Uh, three chickens and three beans. Okay. All right, you have that. Uh, we are now going for the Moxa Stick. Which is going to be... Us, uh to the left and slightly down. So, yeah, this this dog guy right here. All right. We want the silver sheath next. 
And where's that? Which will be uh, straight to the right. Second stall. Um, uh, the golden, the other goods. All right, you want the sunstone. So talk to him again? No, you're good. You've, you've got the silver sheath. The sunstone is the next item, which is going to be all the way to the left on this row. This, this other guy. Uh, trade the limestone and rice. Because some of these do give you options. Now, from here, we're going to go back around and follow the left wall up. All the way to the top, almost on the screen transition. Higher, a little higher, this lady. Spoon? Uh, you want one spoon. All right, got the spoon. Uh, now we can go down and get bronze gauntlets. Where are they? Which are... Um, all the way down, all the way to the right. So if, if you tap the run button, it, you'll, it'll just last longer. Yeah, 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 stutter stepping. There we go. And the third person here. The dog? Yeah, dogman. One right. spoon and two tapestries. All right, bronze gauntlets. Wait, no, we got that just now. Obsidian helmet, which is uh, go left, up, left. It's a guy, the stall with the helmets. This guy. Okay. Uh, Centurion helmet. Talk to him again. Centurion helmet. Yes. Talk to him again. Okay. Take the trade. All right. Um, we're almost done. Drop a save state if you can. And now we're going to go buy a stone vest, which is going to be left, up, and then take a right at the guy feeding chickens. Take a right and the third stall with the armor. All right. Yes. Now go talk to the weirdo. The, the, the old guy? The, the prophet. Yeah. Mash through and do not transform him. I'm glad we did the voice acting bit earlier. So he's a train cape. That's correct. You've done it. Congratulations. You currently have all the best armor for the next boss fight. Okay, so now I'm just waiting out the timer. We're just waiting out the timer, which should be rather short. You'll know because the music will stop. Keep talk, busy juggling. Like that? Like that. And you see how everyone's starting to move and meander? This was your guy. He was All in the hail the mighty and powerful sacred dog! In honor of the sacred dog's appearance, there will be a battle in the Colosseum! Our champion will fight a challenger to be chosen by the sacred dog! Show us, sacred dog! Show us who the challenger shall be! Of course, it's gonna come right to me. Because hey, hey, it's it's my human. Zappa? My human is here. Is that you? Well, You're the sacred dog. Well, that figures. The sacred dog has chosen Tiny. Take our challenger to the Colosseum. I am tiny. You're coming with me.
You wait here, Tiny waits outside. That's where nobody gets hurt. Not until you find Vigor anyway. <laughs> that guy has some sense of humor. Greetings, Challenger. I am Bombolonius, advisor to the leader of Nobilia. Uh, hi, I'm Flightless. There's been some sort of mistake. I'm not really the gladiator funny type. But you were chosen! There's no denying that. You are going to fight! Now, I'm going to leave and let you prepare. The gate will close behind me. When it comes again, uh, that's a cue to come out swinging! Should have recorded your progress because of this guy. Yes. You know, I I'm surprised that we actually got through the whole thing effectively. Nice. Well done. We did it. That actually has a lot more time than you think you have. Fight. Well, Zappa, this is another fine mess you got us into. Here I am about to take out some two spitting sword carry champion gladiator. And all I've got is a femur, a claw, and a stick. Oof. Okay, so grab this box. Now go down around. Hey, look, that's your free upgrade. That would have been a piece of armor, but instead you got an accessory. You got a trinket. It's in your, your item pouch. Thank you, Vita. Oh, look at the eyes on that thing. Poke increase the wearer's ability to evade attacks. Cool. Yeah. So now you're going to be what, grab that and then haul wug this right side. Haul wug it. The dog just went in it. Yep. Good. He's smart. Him smart. Wax, call beat, gloves of raw. Free upgrade. A lot of call beats. That, that was a piece of equipment. That was the, the, the wrist guards that you didn't have. You know how you had three of each? There's your starting one. Gloves of raw. Well, I'm not wearing any prehistoric garbage anymore. Nope. So there are... There are some tricks to fighting this guy, but I'll let you, you know, get your, your footing for the start. Oh, I'm on my Zappa. You stay here, Zappa. Don't get in trouble. Aw, he's so adorable. <laughs> Do we have a thug's cloak? Oh. Watch the stick. Silver sheets. Hey, wa uh, ch watch the background. Watch the background. Harvest Moon. Final Fantasy VI. People are here. Oh, it's Moogle! You pay for an it's entire seat, but you're only going to need the edge. This is the main event. Entering the Coliseum. The King of Chaos! The Babylonian Bruiser! The Provisor Prince of Pandemonium! Vigor the Indestructible! Okay, I wasn't expecting oh God. that. Yeah, I see a Moogle. Yes. I can't tell. Is that Strago? It's Lock, Strago, Realm, Terra, and Umaro. Nice. And introducing the challenger. Some loser with a stick. Boo this man. Boo him. Well, it's good to know that the crowd is on my side. This is like the big fight scene in Dirt Swords, Sweat, and Togas. I think the hero got pummeled in that picture. Ah, well, here goes nothing. So that line changes depending on the weapon you have equipped. Let the battle begin. So there's there's two tricks. When he comes from the right side, stand there. Because then he, he can't charge you, and then you just got to dodge that and do that. Now, when he does this, on the right side, you're going to want to be on the top half. And he gets trapped behind the pillar, and then you can throw through the pillar. You can cheese it. But th th there is a, a caveat. Hit him. You want to hit him from behind. That's kind of hard to do. Well, you can once he goes by. Does that. I think I hit him. Chunk. Yes, you hit him. 
That was a confirmed hit noise. You'll probably kill him off screen at this rate. Imagine using the, the bone. Yeah, I'm doing a lot of damage here. Or the axe. Imagine having to do this without a spear. I like my spear. Imagine a randomizer and you can't do it with a spear. You don't uh, have a spear. Yeah, that would be less cool. See, see how he charges you? That's why yeah, you I stand like, behind him. I like pillar. dodging better up here. I, I mean... Pop! To, to hit him. Yeah, you did! Like, imagine how you do this without a spear. <laughs> Level 14 and 1,000 duels. Get money. Foilus is victorious! Congratulations, we underestimate your abilities. Please accept this sword as an award. I don't really know if I want a sword. Thanks. But you know, what I really like is a clue. Where are we? Oh, oh my bad, I'm doing the wrong voice. <clears throat> That's true, you're being sassy. <laughs> oh, yeah. <clears throat> That's how I was being sassy, thank you. Uh, where are we? What are we doing here? How do we get back to Podunk? Hmm, your answers lie on the west side of the river. They're in the diamond eyes of the sacred dog statue. With these treasures, our leader will have the power to send you back to where you belong. You guys are really on a sacred dog kick. This dog is really my buddy, Zappa. He just hasn't been himself lately. The statue bearing his likeness holds great power, and the diamond eyes are the key. We need the adventurous skills of you and your dog to find and bring back the jewels. Well, as Dusty Duffy McGander says in Perilous Patrol over Pluto, we may not have a rat's chance in a room full of cats, but we're gonna go out to that cheese. It's actually a nice line. Let's go, Zappa. Woo. It was kind of cool to see the Final Fantasy VI characters in the background, too. Have you found the diamond eyes yet, number two? Not yet, your cleanliness. You have offered awards and adventures in the town and on the river shore. You mean to tell me that you have those unkept cretins look for the jewels? This is an important job. Not something that should be left to brutes with no sense of personal hygiene. They may not be clean, but they know their way around this world. That boy you warned me about is also looking for the jewels. If he survives, I'll have a little surprise for him and his dog when they return. You already had that problem with the meddling kid on Plateau number two. Don't let it happen again here. Try to keep the old coot on the other side of the river out of this. I've said before and I'll say it again. Let me control text boxes! I don't know why anyone thought it would be a good idea just to have automated text advance. Like... C cinematic and you're not there? But, it, but they make it go so fast! Like, why do you have it turned up to that speed? You know? That's a good question, Mega Man. And, and I've said that about a lot of games. Like, there's been a lot of games where I've said, let me control text boxes. Uh, Final Fantasy VIII, I think, did it. Um, oh, I'm sure. I'm sure. And and I, 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 I like... I, I don't know. I'm, I I know the older games and all, but still, it's it's one of those things where... It's sort of like whenever I complain about um, uh, there's audio in game, uh, there's voice audio. Um, why is there not a controller to control voice audio? That doesn't make any sense to me. Like, why can I not control the way that people sound? Because they're always turned down low. Or, even worse, playing Final Fantasy IX, you cannot control the sound at all. You can't turn down the sound, you can't turn up the sound. It's it's just a static thing. I don't that's, know. I, I'm like, lame. I'm like, why? Oh, looks like we got a work cut out for Zappa. 
There's a town on the other side of the desert. We can cross the river there. Then we can start searching for those diamonds. Got a dog back! <laughs> He's smelling the chicken feet, I think. So let's go check one more time with this guy that I thought sold you stuff. Hey, you're fully upgraded. There we go. One spear is the same damage as a sword. I'd rather have the spear. Yeah, and this, the sword does not serve any puzzle function. Also, he's sniffing the water. No, he's or sniffing he's... the chicken. <laughs> well, <laughs> he doesn't drop anything, so. Oh, where are we going? Uh, back into the market. Stay along the top row and go to the right. Talk to this guy again with the fish. Okay, nothing then. Fine. Alright, I guess it's just a second chance to get the cure alchemy. Or maybe Possibly. that's just something that's extra marked for the rando. I don't know. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter, and you are brilliant, and you are loved, and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.